In Namesworks, you can find differences between two versions of model. Now let's try it. Home, Append, and let's go to our materials. Material, 11 folder, and let's use this one and I'll control this one. Now in our scene we have two models, this one and this one. And we can compare it. When we have two models selected, we can go to Home Panel and this button is active now. Compare. And you know, and you should know that we can compare not only two models completely, we even can, can compare the levels. This one and this one. And the same one. And even we can go to walls and walls. And we can try to find difference between walls or between even two single objects from, from different models and even from the one model. And let's try to work with the whole models. Take this one and this one and let's press it. And in this two, in the left side, we have mm, the opportunities for differences. We can find difference in type, name, properties. But first of all, I am interested in geometry. One, geometry. And from the right side, there are the results. And we can ask Nerdsworks to make selection sets for differences. But I recommend you to use this one and this one. Set each difference as set. To have for every difference a uh, single set and to check all of your set, all of your differences. Here you can remove all results if it's not the first one, comparing from these models. And hide matches and all the matches. Elements will be hide. And highlight results with special, with special structure or colors. You can use overridden Overridden material and overridden transforms, oh. finding the differences, and this means that if you changed the material on the scale of the form during, in, during the nearest for scene, really in the nearest for not in the native file, you can check it too. But now we don't want to do it, and let's go with this one, with this settings, geometry and all the results. Press OK. And now we have only objects with differences, but they are not highlighted. Uh, we should change the viewpoint, viewpoint, and render mode to shade it. And let's change the background, background, horizontal. And now all the elements which are different to, to models are red, and the cyan mod, cyan color means that this model has has some new elements apart from another model. Okay, and let's activate the set panel. And now we can see that for compare you, there is a special sense for everything. The set for for the elements from the one model, the set from the elements for the second model. But more interesting is this one. For every Every difference, there is a special set. Okay, I can take it and then let's uh, go to the home and unhide all. And now, as you see, all the elements with no difference are white. And I want to find out where is in the model, where is the difference. I want to go to the home, then to select and not select all but invert selection. And then let's go to the item tools and change this option transparency close to close to this one. And now, as you can see, there's the red one elements here. There's the red one elements, and when we take it, you can understand where it is. And so when you have the Set for every differences. You can check all the sets and and analyze where it's in the model and what is the reason of it.